Hey guys, it's Michelle. Happy to be back online. I think I'm finally getting back on schedule. I remember my New Year's resolution was to do videos on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and we see how well that has worked out. <laughs> I told you guys I couldn't stick to a resolution. I tried. I think I made it like a month without screwing that up, but anyway, please pardon my hair. It really needs cut, and I look like, a, well, I kind of have a horsey mane going on today. It looks really bad. Say la vie. I wanted to, um, I've been piling up these face masks that I've been using so I could do a video. So I wanted to share these with you guys in case you wanted to run out and get one or if you have opinions on any face masks that you happen to love, please let me know. I am, I have to try just about any of them because I love to do at least like three or four face masks a week and I try to switch it up between the peel off and the regular ones and some kind of funky ones. So anyway, I've got several here and um, let's just get on with it. Uh, because, you know, I want to talk about something besides beauty community drama. Let's get back to the makeup, shall we? Thank you. This first one is a coconut and clay peel-off mask. I got this one at Walmart. I think it was like $1.27 or something. Loved it. Absolutely loved it. It smells like coconut. It peeled off well. I hate peel-off masks that don't peel off well. Like, there was a Wonder Beauty mask that we got in one of our subscription boxes like a month or two ago. I think sucked. It was just horrible. But these little ones from Walmart... They're like less than $1.50 and they work really well. This is an easy peel clay mask that hydrates and nourishes. And I really like this one. So I'm going to buy some more of these. And I love that smell. Reminds me of summer. And I think I just got it up my nose. <laughs> um, I also have this gingerbread one that I bought at Christmas. And I don't know if these things expire or not. I don't see a date on this. But anyway, they were 5 for $5 at 5 Below, I think. Yeah, pardon my stutter. You guys know that I can't talk. Um, these were really good. They were Christmas ones. And this one... Still smells like gingerbread. I've, I had to keep all these in a plastic bag because there's a little bit of oozing going on. So it's, it's kind of sticking to my hand. It's gross. <laughs> Another thing I've been doing lately is getting face masks on eBay because you can get them from, you know, one of those countries over there, which I'm not going to mention because, well, I don't monetize my videos, but I just don't want to be tagged for anything by mentioning a country. Anyway, I get these from um, one of those countries over there, way, way over there. <laughs> and, um, this looks like a pill. I don't, I don't know if you guys can tell what that is, but it's blueberries. And this one smelled really good too. This was more like a gel though. It's a blueberry jelly mask. And they come in um, cherry blossom and one other one. I've ordered a cherry blossom one and it hasn't come yet, but I'm really excited about using that one. But I did like this one too. This was just kind of a... I didn't know if I was supposed to wash it off or not, so I just left it on my face and rubbed it in. It, it didn't do anything bad to me, so... Uh, I guess I'm okay. The next one is from Tony Moly, and I love Tony Moly face masks and eye masks, um, eye, eye patches. This is Panda's Dream Eye Patch. And like the idiot that I am, I did it when I was half asleep, like four in the morning or something. And uh, I cut it in half because I'm like, how come there's only one in here? Should I have ordered two of them? No, there's two of them in here. They're just back to back on a piece of plastic and you have to peel them off. I felt so stupid. <laughs> but anyway, um, I like this. It didn't irritate my eyes or anything, but be careful with that sort of thing. You know, use it at your own risk. Uh, it says leave on for 10 to 20 minutes to remove. I just left it on for 15 minutes with my regular face mask. I slapped one of those on top of it and uh, I liked it. It was mild. It didn't really smell like anything and uh, I like this. I may order those again. And last but not least, I have one, two, three. Oh, they're so stuck together. I think I have five. Yeah, five Tony Moly masks these big giant ones. I actually ordered, um, I think it was 12 for $13 or 13 for $12. I got them on eBay and you can get that deal, um, pretty often. So I've got five of these. This one was my favorite. I think so far, this was the rice mask sheet for clear skin. And, um, this one was really good. It was very mild and definitely moisturized. Sometimes, you know, you're just like, okay, I put moisturizer on my face from a sheet mask and you know, five minutes later, you can't tell. But this one really kept my skin looking good the rest of the day. I also, surprisingly enough, like this uh, broccoli mask for Vitality. It didn't smell like broccoli. I was so worried about them. I'm like, what is that gonna smell like? That could be just disgusting. But no, it didn't. It, it had a very light scent to it. And um, this one I also enjoyed a great deal. Um, a good tip for you guys, if you want to get a really good wake up call in the morning, you should put these in the refrigerator for a few minutes and put on a cold face mask. That is so cool. It feels really good. Then I did the tomato mask sheet for Radiance. I've seen these like a billion times and I was always afraid to use them, but since it came in my packet, um, I decided to use it and I like this one as well. It was a lot better than I thought it was going to be and it didn't smell like tomatoes. <laughs> the next one is the seaweed mask skin purifying re uh, blah, blah, blah. Wow. 
anyway, this is the seaweed one. And um, this one was just blah. It didn't do anything really exciting that I could tell. I mean, it didn't hurt me in any way. It's just moisturizing my skin. Um, another thing about sheet masks, don't leave them on any longer than you're supposed to because the mask will start to soak the stuff back up from your face or something. At least that's what I've heard. So it kind of defeats the purpose to put it on, leave it on too long, let it dry out, and it starts to soak the moisture back out of your face and you end up looking uh, 47 like me. <laughs> Don't want to talk about it. The last one that I have right now is the avocado mask for nutrition. I like this one too, surprisingly enough. This one was nice and moisturizing, and um, it, I'll probably order this one again too. I have six or seven more left. I didn't do the math on that, um, but I'm going to order those again, I think, from Facebook. I think, or not Facebook. Wow, do I keep saying that? I mean eBay. Um, so anyway, I'm going to save. I've got a pile probably this high face masks and since I do three or four a week I'm gonna try to do reviews on these every so often maybe once a month if you guys have any suggests good grief I'm gonna have to do this video again no I'm not I'm just gonna leave it the way it is because I'm human and I don't edit and this is me just being me and you know to know me is to love me so I am what I am anyway if you could let me know if you want me to do these like every two weeks if you want to hear it like once a month just let me know down in the comments I really appreciate you guys being with me my May 2019 May Flowers giveaway is still going on until the, the, I think it was the 26th. I put it down below because I can't remember. I'll have to look at the video. And I'll link the video down below too that you can go into my uh, giveaway. All you have to do is be subscribed. I give up. I give up. I give up. I think I need caffeine. Be subscribed to my channel and leave a co comment on that particular video. Wow, it's been a long day. It's just really been a long day. <laughs> and it's only like 1130. Say lovey. You guys know how I am. I can't talk. I can't think. I'm just a goofball. And, you know, you're going to get nothing but the truth from me because I have no reason to lie and I really don't want any drama on YouTube. Life is hard enough with, you know, real life problems and not all this stupid crap that's going on. And that's all I have to say about that. <laughs> anyway, uh, get in the giveaway as soon as I hit 100 subscribers. I'm at 98 right now. I have a huge giveaway to do and I'll try to link that one down below too if I can find it. Um, but I haven't started that giveaway yet. But as soon as I hit 100 subs, I have two huge boxes full of makeup and brushes and all kinds of things that somebody's going to win. So um, please subscribe to the channel and let's get past that 100 mark. It's been over a year now and I'm like, is anybody watching? <laughs> but uh, I know some of you do because you send me the sweetest comments and emails and things. And especially when I was missing the past three weeks. Just so you know, um, my mom is doing okay. She's out of the hospital. And I thank you guys for inquiring. And... Um, it's just been kind of a rough month, so I want to get back into my videos and talk about makeup and shoes and shopping and life and lipstick and love and whatever pops into my head and, you know, we'll just talk. We'll just chat and there will be no drama. <laughs> I hope you guys have a blessed day. Bye.